Hello beautiful people and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Roslyn. On this channel I feature lifestyle, inspiration, and a lot of self-care. In today's video, I am going to be giving you eight reasons why I think you should switch from coffee to tea. Let's get started. Alright, so today I'm going to try to convince you to switch from coffee to tea or maybe drink more tea and less coffee. So my first reason I think that you should switch from coffee to tea is that tea is so hydrating. Now while coffee can do the same thing, tea has the added benefit of generally being just pure H2O. It has a really nice tea flavor and you really don't have to add a lot to it. You can drink it when it's cold outside. You can drink it very warm when it's hot outside. And it really helps you replace the fluids that you've lost when you're sweating, when it's hot outside. It's also really good for your skin and your hair. It's loaded with antioxidants and it makes your skin very soft, subtle, gives you kind of like this glowy look. And then it also helps fight the signs of aging. So number two, tea will keep you going. Tea has the same amount of caffeine as coffee and while they both are stimulants, coffee has a much bigger effect on you. So usually it reduces your energy level, um, but it gives you a bigger rush in terms of coffee. And then once your rush is gone, it kind of like disintegrates. But if you're wanting something that really keeps you going throughout the workday, tea is definitely your best choice. Number three, it's much easier than making coffee. So all you have to do to brew up some tea is just really make sure that you have some hot water and then put your tea back in. You can remove it after a few minutes and you're done. Now with the world of coffee nowadays, gourmet coffee, we want all these different things within our coffee, even if it is cold coffee we want all these different things within our coffee so usually just pouring your coffee having it black is usually not a choice for most people most people like all of the other additives so it is definitely easy if you like all the extra things in your coffee to make some tea Number four, tea can actually help you shed some unwanted weight. Now there is a little research on green tea. It actually helps to kickstart your metabolism. So it's a better substitute than some of the soft drinks or even some of the calorie free drinks because you get some of the nutrients um, that you wouldn't get if you were drinking uh, something other than tea. My fifth point is that tea is pretty good for your teeth um, when you manage it in comparison to coffee um, because tea comes in a lot of flavors and a lot of different colors. You don't really have to worry about the unwanted side effects of discoloration when it comes to drinking tea like you do with coffee. My sixth point is that it can also protect your bones. There was an Australian study that found that people who drank tea on a regular basis had stronger bones and were less likely to develop osteoporosis thanks to the high level of tea catchlins in it. Um, and there's also another study a few years earlier that found that drinking tea helped promote healthy bone formation. While I wouldn't recommend drinking tea alone for your bone health, I think it is a great secondary option. Number seven, tea can actually help reduce stress. Now we know that a lot of cultures use tea, especially like the British cultures. Um, it's ingrained in their customs and they use it as kind of like a bonding tool as well as refreshments. But green tea has been found to work as an antidepressant, meaning that taking a cup the next time you're feeling a little low might just help boost your mood. Number eight, which is my favorite, tea can actually help strengthen your immune system. All right, so number eight, tea can actually help strengthen your immune system. Now, if you are battling like a cold or a flu or something like that, if you're drinking tea, especially with a lot of different teas mixed together, it can help you flush out your system and it can also help you keep hydrated, something that you definitely need when you're not feeling well. The minerals and vitamins inside the tea can be just the pick me up your system needs to help you get back on track. Well, that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next video. Bye.